Hello video editors, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to show you, how you can create, a video grid, or video wall, just like the example, that you are watching now. And we will do, all this, in Adobe Premiere Pro. So let's start. Now that, we are inside Premiere Pro, now first, we will create, a new sequence. 1920 by 1080. It's important to show you that, we are working, with a sequence, with a 16 to 9 aspect ratio. It's important. Because this tutorial is based, on a 16 to 9 aspect ratio. Here, we have taken, a lot of footage. All video footage is, 1920 by 1080. Now drag all the footages, over to the timeline, that we need, for editing process. And you can see, one of these footages, also has audio. We don't need, the audio, for this video. So we will delete the audio. Now, we can start by simply, stacking the clips, on top of each other. Now, you can see, they all have a different duration. But that doesn't matter as long as you have 9 clips, on top of each other. Now, we are going to, make all the clips, equal in length. And to do this, we first need to, switch over, to the razor tool, by clicking the C key, or hit this icon here. Then, we will cut, all the clips evenly. And then, switch back to the selection tool, by clicking on the V key, or click this icon here. And then, select the part, that we just cut off. And we will remove, these now. Because, we do not need them. Now, we can fix, the difference in resolution. First, we will select, all the clips. And then, right click, and select, scale to frame size. This will change, all the clips, to the size of the sequence. 1920 by 1080, and scaling is set to 100%. So, we have got, 9 stacked video clips, with equal duration size, and aspect ratio, because, we are going to, divide 9 videos, across the screen, we need to, scale the video down, in video grid, with 9 videos, we have got, 3 videos, per horizontal row, so 100% width, divided by 3 is 33.3%. First, we will select a video, then from the effects control panel, the scale will be 33.3%. Then you can see, the video has shrunk, to the middle. Now, we will copy the motion tab, of this video, by clicking Ctrl plus C, and paste it, on all the other video clips, by clicking Ctrl plus V. Then all our videos, will be the same size, as you can see. Let's say, that is our 16 to 9 sequence with a 1920, by 1080 resolution. If we divide this, by 3, we will get a line, on these points. But because, the anchor point is, in the middle, we need to, use the position. For the first clip, this will be 320, by 180. And for the next one, 960 by, 180, and so on. And in the end, these are numbers, that we are going to use, for a 1080p sequence. Now, we can simply, change the position, of each clip, with the numbers, in the scheme. So, for clip number 1, it will be, 320 by, 180. And for the next one, it will be, 960 by 180. And so on. I think, you get the point, so let's speed up, the video. I perfectly, divided the video grid. And if you like, you could also, add some borders, on top. 
I have some overlay grid. You can simply, import them, into your project panel, inside Premiere Pro. This overlays, have 4K resolution, so you need to, scale it down, if you use, 1920 by 1080p sequence. I will add a link, in the video description, where you can, download these overlays, for free. I hope, you enjoyed it, and if you did, then please, like the video, or leave a comment below. Thanks for watching, and I hope, you have a wonderful day.